Namaskar, I am Dr. Amit Bardwaj, scientist from India Meteorological Department. I welcome you all for the daily weather briefing for India Meteorological Department for today, 26th September. Now, if you can see that uh, um, uh, southeast monsoon is start withdrawal. So, as you can see in this blue color line, uh, this is the portion where the southeast monsoon has uh, withdrawn. Now, conditions are becoming more favorable for further uh, withdrawal of the southeast monsoon from uh, some more parts of the northwest India and adjoining western India during next two, two to three days. So, this is the, uh, the condition. Now, if we come uh, to the observational data which are uh, uh, reported by IMD observatories uh, since last 24 hours. So you can see in this picture, uh, the yellow color has been shown for the heavy rainfall. As you can see, there are uh, uh, heavy rainfall has been reported from uh, Jharkhand, Tamil Nadu, some of the stations are been listed here and the amount is also listed. And Konkan and Goa, Marathwada, Gujarat state 7 cm in one of the station and Telangana and some more you can see from uh, here Arun Arunachal Pradesh also isolated places uh, some station also reported the heavy rainfall amount. So these are the uh, observation reported. Now if we go to the uh, today's highlight as we already know uh, the condition are becoming more favorable for further withdrawal of the southwest monsoon and uh, from some more parts of northwest uh, India and adjoining western India during next to two to three days this is uh, one significant and there is also a low pressure area is likely to form over North Andaman and adjoining East Central Bay around 30th of September. So, and uh, it is likely to move uh, west northwestward, and uh, it will uh, possibility of gradual intensification. The another significant weather is a fresh spell of very heavy uh, rainfall likely over East uh, India from 29th of September, as you can see due to this uh, system, uh, the rainfall will increase. Now, if we Come to the uh, today's uh, synoptic features. As you can see, there is a cyclonic circulation uh, which is uh, there uh, uh, over uh, uh, East Uttar Pradesh uh, adjoining Bihar at uh, 3.1 km above mean sea level. You can also see that there is a cyclonic circulation over Telangana region uh, which is extend up to 2.1 km from mean sea level and uh, there is a uh, trough line uh, from East Vidarbha to South Konkan region at the mid tropospheric level that means 4.5 and uh, 5.8 kilometer above mean sea level and there is also a cyclonic circulation over uh, west central bay uh, of uh, coastal uh, Andhra Pradesh uh, at the mid tropospheric level has been seen and you can also see that there is a system like western disturbance uh, a fresh spell of WD is uh, uh, located at uh, present uh, at 60 degree and uh, east and 30 degree north at uh, 5.8 km above mean sea level. So due to these system, there will be a spell of uh, uh, rainfall and the five days warning IMD is providing. And these are been uh, shown in uh, these uh, five days graphical format. As you can see for the day one, due to the trough and the cyclonic circulation, uh, th there are uh, 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 heavy rainfall can happen over isolated places over uh, coastal Andhra Pradesh, Telangana, uh, Karnataka region and uh, Konkan and Goa region as well as you can see for day one uh, Andaman and Nicobar Island isolated heavy places uh, heavy rainfall can happen. Now if we come to the day two only coastal Karnataka and uh, Andaman Nicobar and Madhya Maharashtra region will receive the isolated places of heavy rainfall. Now if we go to the day three uh, the very very heavy rainfall uh, at isolated places uh, uh, likely to happen over uh, Konkan and Goa region and uh, heavy rainfall over uh, Madhya Maharashtra, uh, Goa, Kerala and uh, isolated location of the Tamil Nadu region. As you can also see for day 3 onwards, uh, Andaman and Nicobar Island uh, uh, at isolated places can receive very he heavy rainfall from day 3, day 4 and day 5 due to the formation of the low pressure area over uh, 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 near Andaman Sea. Now if we come to the day 4, as you can see low pressure will form and will, it will cause uh, it will uh, show increased spell of the heavy rainfall so the Odisha region is also is, uh, at isolated places for day 4 and day 5 the eastern coast will uh, gain more uh, isolated location of heavy rainfall for day 4 as you can see uh, Odisha and the eastern sorry uh, the west coast of India uh, including Madhya Maharashtra, Konkan Goa 
Karnataka, Kerala and Tamil Nadu at isolated places heavy rainfall is receiving and this activity will increase on day 5 also uh, over Odisha, Jharkhand, Chhattisgarh, uh, coastal Andhra Pradesh, Tamil Nadu, Kerala and the Karnataka region as well as uh, Konkan and Goa isolated location heavy rainfall will receive. So these are the warning for 5 days so uh, I'll come back to you tomorrow uh, for another day forecast. So I thank you for today.